really wanna perpetrate, cause this 38 will be designated for all those who hate it like just man, I'm contemplating. Your moves you lose, now your hot you gave me. New moves, more dudes, now the top you made me. Same rules, new moves, now the clutch you made me. Hey, what's up, y'all? Now, this joint right here looks, it, this to me, the title of the song looks funny. White guy goes to black strip club. Man, we about to check this joint out, man. I, I, I can't even, I can't even wait to check this joint out, man. Uh, so let's go ahead and check it out. See what it's about. Yeah, let me know what y'all think in the comments below. Um, please don't forget to check out LFR Nye and LFR JoJo's channel. They are doing amazing. That's my son and my daughter. Extremely proud of them and their channels. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Andrew Kahn is what it says. All right, where they go? So my boy hits me up. He's like, hey, I'm about to take your ass to a real strip club. I was like, what you mean a real one? Well, I've been going to fake ones? He was like, no, you've been going to white people strip clubs. I'm about to take you to a black people strip club. I was like, there ain't no difference. Ain't no difference. A stripper is a stripper. He's like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. His ass just kept laughing at me. So when we was on our way, the farther we kept driving, the more ghetto we got. More crackheads and pit bulls and shit just standing around, not doing shit. What the hell? More crackheads and pit bulls? Okay. All right, hey, okay. The more ghetto we got. More crackheads and pit bulls and shit just standing around, not doing shit. Well, we finally pull up to this place as soon as I step my foot out the car. It instantly, instantly, smelled like black and miles and gunpowder. Dudes was out there shooting dice, smoking trees and shit. I walked by a dude and he fucking blew it some blunt smoke. Shit got near me. I was like, hey man, blow that shit somewhere else. He's like, shut the fuck up, white boy. I was like, well, damn. He was like, what? I said, black lives matter. Black power, motherfucker. Black power. So we finally make it to the front door. Had to go through two metal detectors and a pat down. I was like, damn or what? Are we about to take a flight? Security guard gonna look at me and say, uh, no, we gotta take precautions. We had a shooting here last week. I was like, well, fuck. <laughs> That's good to know. We finally get to our seats. Got us a good seat. My boy orders his drink. Shot girl looks at me and is like, what you want? I said, uh, let me get a, a Jack and Coke on the rock. She was like, uh, no. Fuck no, white boy. You're actually about to hit, drink some Hennessy. I was like, all right. I'll take some fucking Hennessy. See, the first girl that comes out was busted as shit. Had a C-section scar from hip to hip. I was like, hey. That fucking C-section was done at the house. That's not healthy. <laughs> I don't know what a C-section scar is supposed to look like. But he said the C-section scar on a stripper was from hip to hip. Then he thought that the <laughs> self, self dungeon at the house, okay. Fish starts twirling around that pole. Has a fucking Newport 100 hanging out. Whatever, man. I was like, well, He's dang. making this up. She was a twirling and a twirling. She fucking throws her head back. And I looked at my boy and I was like, oh, shit, her head fell off. He was like, no. That's just a weave. I was like, oh, shit, that's a man. Look, look, look. He said, no, man. Black girls cut their hair real short. It's like put a weave in it. I was like, huh. Whoever said you couldn't learn something at the strip club? Huh? Huh? Didn't that girl gonna have enough nerve to come over and just drop down one time in front of me? He's like, uh, you gonna throw some money? I was like, uh, here you 35 fucking cent? She's like, well, fuck you then. And just walks off. I was like, shit. I looked at my boy and I was like, is it just me? Does this smell just like cocoa butter in this bitch? Smell like cocoa butter and Newports. See, and then, <laughs> there was a light-skinned girl that comes out. When I tell you this girl is, oh man, 
Bitch was thicker than a snicker. She built like a Coke bottle. I was like, Jesus Christ. Would you look at this? Oh, you can tell. This bitch was a professional. Okay, she hops up on that shit. She climbs all the way to the ceiling. Starts doing flips and turns and twirling and shit. She dropped from about 10 feet down to a split. Fucking money started going everywhere. I started slinging every damn dollar I had at her. I told her, I was like, hey, you give me 35 fucking minutes, bitch. I'll go to the house, get my pink slip to my car. Okay? Then my boy gonna have no. I wish your girl could see you right now over here slobbering over this girl. I was like, shit. She, she, my girl always talking about MGK this, MGK that. When it comes to Selena Gomez and this girl right here dancing, I would take both of them home and fuck them on top of my girl, okay? I'd be putting my hand in her face and shit like, just let it happen. Just let it happen. So I... This dude disrespectful, man. <laughs> he disrespectful. He taking two chicks home. And he said they look so good that he going to do them on top of his girl. Like, and just put his hands and just mush her the entire time. Like, just let it happen. This dude, wow, man. Finally admit to my boy, I was like, uh, you were definitely right. These fucking girls make white girls move like sticks. Okay, that one girl made her ass clap so loud. I thought there were shots fired. Okay. Uh, I had the best time of my life. Okay. Had the best time of my life. I told my boy, I was like, look here, we're coming back every single weekend. You don't have to teach my ass how to shoot dice, okay? Shit, the next time I walk up in there, I'm gonna learn how to do the crip walk. I'm just gonna walk in that bitch like that. I'm about to make some motherfucker wanna tell people I'm light-skinned too. I don't give a damn if I gotta do take a bullet for this shit. I'm gonna be back every weekend, every weekend. I don't give a damn if I am the only white boy in there. I'll be in there cheesing, boy. I'll be in there cheesing. Now, I see a rack of thumbnails of people laughing and stuff, like busting out laughing and whatnot. Um, and honestly, I don't see why. I didn't think it was that funny. Sorry, Andrew. I didn't think this joke was that funny. Um, that's just me, though. That's just me. But I'd like to hear what y'all guys say about this. Let me know if y'all thought it was funny. Did y'all think it was funny? Huh? Yeah, let me know in the comments below. And if you have yet to hit the subscribe button, make sure you do so on your way out the door. Uh, once again, guys, my name is Van. And now we are all the LFR family. And I look forward to seeing y'all in the next video, hopefully inside the Patreon as well. Y'all have been amazing. Peace out. Really wanna perpetrate, cause this 38 will be designated for all those who hate it like just man, I don't contemplate it. Your moves, you lose, now your hot you gave me. New moves, more dudes, now the top you made me. Same rules, new food, now the first you made me.